Hello everybody, this is Jay Balls of Fire here, and I promised you something that I'm going to deliver. I promised you a list of the best things on the planet Earth, at least for me. This is my, this is just my humble opinion, but let me go ahead and start this off the right way by saying it is apparent that the best thing on the planet is bacon. I mean, without a fucking doubt, bacon is the best thing on the planet. It's just salty and good and meaty and you can do it crispy you can do it you know you know slow more meatier you know it depends on how you're do, gonna do it but it is you know and you can also get it cut thick you know make bacon i like to call that bacon steak you make bacon steak i need a fork and a knife dude and you really can make that shit happen um number two on my list and you know this is a close number two too is is doing it and just to be honest here i'm married so it's all legit too so ain't nobody gonna hate on me about that but Come on, doing it. Do I really got to say anything else about that? I mean, doing it's pretty awesome. I mean, if you're not doing it, you probably should try it. Yeah, so anyways, move to the next one. Uh, video games. See, that was up there. I was wondering between that, you know, if that should be number two or not, but I'm not sure. I really couldn't figure that out, you know, but I really love video games. I've been playing video games my entire life. I remember at one point being such a hyper little child. The, you know, that was my babysitter. I had Mario 1 in the, like, infinite lives trick my pops used to pull. And bam, dude, I, there you go. You can take a little crazy-ass little J and he'll, like, chill out trying to beat some Mario when he's, like, three. You know, I was, like, three with a million lives trying to beat some Mario. To the next one, uh, Christmas. I mean, this is, like, a no-brainer, right? We all love getting stuff for Christmas, especially free stuff. When you grow up a little bit, it costs you a lot of money, you know, but still... Nonetheless, getting stuff is awesome, but there is an exception to this, you see, because in my list, there's there's an especially, and it's especially if you have kids, Christmas is definitely one of the best things on the whole planet. Now, I can tell you from personal experience that the first time my oldest son was old enough to really understand that he was being a good boy all year, and he was trying to do Christmas and be a... Look at that shit, you stupid phone. Why are you coming there and trying to irritate me? I am doing a video, you son of a bitch. Anyways. Yeah, so anyways. So the first time my son was able to like really like say, you know, this is what I want, you know. And he was like two, maybe two and a half. And he like really understood Christmas. And, you know, he did his part or whatever happened. And Santa delivered, you know. And uh, just the pride and the joy of selflessness. And it was like, I don't know. That uh, sounds corny or nerdy or whatever, but it's the truth. It was probably, you know, I got married and all that good shit. It was probably the happiest day of my life. So, anyways, next on that list would be number five is technology slash electronics. You know, first off, that's what we're bringing this here to. You know, this would not be possible. You would not be graced with the wisdom of J-Balls. If it wasn't for technology, because you guys would just be sitting there and there's so many people I really need to just reach, you know, and I can do that now because of technology and electronics because, you know, video games and TVs and stuff, you know, phones. I mean, f f smartphones are awesome. So let's move on to the next one. Uh, music. I mean, come on. Music is the best shit. I mean, music is so awesome. Like. It pretty much makes everything better. So let's go down this list again with music involved. Now, listen, now, what if I was. You know, frying some bacon up while I was listening to some music, you know, while I was doing it or right after I was doing it and playing video games, you know, I did it, played some video games. Like now I can smell bacon in the air. Maybe my wife's making bacon on Christmas morning while I'm messing around with my phone, you know. Now, all of those things were just made better by music. It was like the ultimate enhancer, you know. So, uh, number uh, seven on that list is explosions. I mean, explosions. I mean, they're just awesome. Everyone loves explosions. How many people do you know just was like, hey, did you know if you did this, 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 this shit explodes? It's huge. You can look it up on YouTube. And you're like, Google it. And they're like, you know, everyone stands around this little, like, five-inch screen, like, staring at something blowing up. You know, blowing shit up school. And in, just to give you a little example, um, I was playing Borderlands 2, and something happened. I clicked something, and I went to something called the Badass Creator of Badassitude. And it was pretty cool. But anyway, as soon as I got in there, this dude's like, do you like explosions? And as soon as he said that, I was sold. I'm like, yeah, I like explosions. So he starts going on this shit, and did, like, little mouth, like, guitar. So I'm like, wow. 
it was awesome, and I was sold. You know, explosions are awesome. Now, number eight. Eight. Number eight on this list is chocolate wave cake from Red Lobster. Now, if you haven't had a chocolate wave cake, you need to take your ass over to Red Lobster and get some chocolate wave because it is good. It is damn good. It is so good. And uh, they like to heat it up for you. I eat that shit cold out the freezer. Now, I go to Red Lobster. I said, look, I want some. They're like, you want dessert? I'm like, yeah, let me get a piece of chocolate wave. How much is that piece of chocolate wave? They're like, oh, it's like seven bucks. I'm like, seven bucks? I'm not paying, I don't want to pay seven bucks. Now, it's worth seven bucks, but I don't want to pay that. I'm a cheap ass. So, I'm like, look, how about you instead sell me the whole cake? How much for the whole cake? They're like, I don't know, 30 bucks, 35 bucks. I'm like, 35 bucks? How many pieces? They're like, 16. I said, 16 pieces for 35 bucks? Give me that whole damn cake. Don't even cut me a piece. Just send that whole cake out here. I'm going to take it home. I'm going to put it in my freezer. And you know you put it in the freezer because you think you're going to like, it's going to last because it's all those pieces of cake and they are huge hearty pieces of cake. And no, they don't. You just eat the shit out of the chocolate cake because it's just so damn good. You can't stop eating it. Number nine. Doing it. Did I mention that already? Doing it? Doing it's awesome. I mean, like, if you're not doing it, you know, you probably should start trying it. You know, or get married or whatever. I don't know. I'm not trying to be all like crazy and put a wig right and you know, start some shit up or whatever. But I'm just being for real, doing it. It's awesome. You know, and I'm going to quote somebody who mentioned this once before because this is an original concept, you know, but not everybody does it, but everybody should. You know, if you're not like hip to that, I'm going to quote that out. This is my man, George Michael. I don't remember what song it was, but he totally is like, just know he nailed it in that song. He nailed like how awesome doing it was in that song. So, uh, 10 gets epic nerdy. These are things that I love, you know, uh, it's, it's cartoons. I love cartoons and, uh, anime, whatever, but I like cartoons and anime. I've been watching it my whole life. I didn't want to stop now that I'm older. I just want to keep doing it. You know, that's what I like watching cartoons, listening to music while bacon is cooking Doing it? Did I already say doing it? Okay, so let's just pass that up now. Doing it's awesome. Let's not get wrong, but it's not bacon. You know, it's really not bacon. Now, I did add one on there, an extra one on this list. Probably because of my situation, but it's air conditioning. You see this burn-ass nose? That is from the sun. Sunburn. My pasty ass. Pasty ass. The sunburn. Oh, that shit sucks. So anyways, I get so hot, I'm glowing. Turn the air conditioner on. Stand in front of the air conditioner. Bam! You know, if you're from Siberia, you can just cross out air conditioning and put in like a furnace, you know, because furnaces probably are the bees knees out that way. We need furnaces too up here in Ohio, but you know, right now it's August and we need air conditioning because sometimes it gets hot as balls, you know. I like to just regulate. I like to regulate the hottest balls niche or something, whatever, no, don't listen to me, so anyways, that's my list, uh, I'm going to totally have to change this list around and do it again one day, as my taste change, because I am an ever-evolving human, and my tastes are going to change, as I hope yours do too, you know, but anyways, if you like this video, hit the like button, hit twice, I don't know if that does anything, but I can try it, I'd try it if I were you, especially I would try it if I were you, you know what I'm saying, but hit the subscribe button, i give you more of this, there'll be a lot more of this with that that, that this come from whatever that's what i'm saying but if you hit the subscribe button leave a comment below let me know what you want me to talk about because i got all kinds i got opinion on everything i'm like so full of shit i'm gonna just deliver it to you so thank you guys for watching this is j balls ah!